guys welcome back to my channel it's been a while so today we're going to be customizing my frontal so i have a lace frontal wig that i got from my brand and we'll be using 30 developer powdered bleach a tupperware container and a brush so for step one all you're going to do is you're going to take the powdered bleach and pour it into the container what I suggest is that you put a lot of powder and only a little bit of the developer just because you do not want to get a very thin consistency as when that see that will seep through the lace and it will end up not only bleaching your frontal but also the hair and that's not what we're going for so as I do is I pour a little bit and I mix and then I add a little bit more and once I have a really thick consistency then I know I'm ready to go and if I ever add too much developer I just add a little bit more of the of the bleach sorry not dye so once that's all mixed up as you can see I'm mixing I always check my consistency so as you can see that consistency works and that's what we're gonna go with so I'm going to take that now, and then I'm just going to apply it to the lace, which brings us to step two. So for step two, all you're going to do is you're going to apply that thick layer onto the lace. This lace came pre-plucked, so I have to push in the little flyaways to make sure because you do not want those to be dyed. So once that's done, you're just going to apply the thick layer of bleach to the frontal what I suggest is I find the thicker is better because it's less likely to seep through and if it does it's not as bad as if it was thin so 15 minutes later now I'm going to wash off the frontal I use lukewarm water when I am washing off the frontal and it's a black or dark colored hair I'm not really picky with the shampoo that I use that's just me some people are really picky I'm not so for me I use turbo lessons as a simple shampoo you can even get at like the dollar store and I use that on it whereas my conditioner I'm a little bit more picky because I co-wash all my hair and I used ion this has been I've been using this one for years and I find it to be really good so all you're gonna do is condition and shampoo the hair and make sure you get it you get the lace really, really well because you do not want to have any leftover bleach because you'll definitely have patches of blonde in your hair. For me, when I did this, I am, some of the hair did get bleached, as you can see in step four. So I will do another video because unfortunately I didn't get the chance to show you guys what I did to make my frontal to take, sorry, to take care of the the brassy bleach you can see. I'll do another video on how I get rid of that. If you ever need to do it on a, like very, very quickly, I suggest you use mascara. That's what I do. If I ever notice that I can see some of the bleach, I just put mascara in my hair. Otherwise, I normally just tone and it kind of, it just goes away. So here I, I'm just plucking the lace. You want to make sure that you just... It looks as natural as possible. That's the goal. Because this hair is pretty puffy and it's a water wave, I didn't go crazy with the plucking, but I did definitely want to make sure it was plucked enough to look natural. So for some people, they part and pluck. I do that too, but I prefer sometimes to comb and then pluck, comb and then pluck, which is what you see me doing. And I just keep doing that. There's many different ways to customize your frontal, but this was just a quick way for me. Sometimes it is easier to part, but again, I didn't want to take out too much hair because this hair was a, is very puffy when it's dry, so I didn't want to have the lace too thin. So as you can see, it's not too thin, and that's all the hair that I plucked out, a handful of it. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to get any footage of myself once I applied the wig. So I put on a couple of pictures so that you guys can see what it looked like once it was on my head and I got rid of the blonde that was seeping through due to the bleach. 
so i hope you guys enjoyed the video like and comment and subscribe